are some of the challenges in test reporting? It sounded like you were just talking about one just there. <laughs> yeah, that was my biggest recent challenge in test reporting. <laughs> um, some challenges in test reporting. Hmm. I guess I referred to them, uh, but not specifically earlier. So if you are uh, telling a very long story, then people may not be listening. Um, or vice versa, if you decide for yourself that something is important and then you do not report it and it turns out to be important, then that is also bad. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, I re one of the reasons, I guess the main reason that I left my first job was that I was the only tester there and I found it really hard to not have someone to just bounce an idea off of to say, this kind of seems weird to me, should I escalate it? Just get that like quick second opinion mm. um, before deciding whether to go big and, and, and escalate it. Um, yeah, I think just, yeah, having that fast feedback and someone that uh, you're willing to bother without bothering them <laughs> uh, can be helpful. I'm trying to think of other problems in test reporting. I guess the, the biggest thing is that people, uh, when you get the feedback from your testing, uh, the where the only piece of information someone cares about is whether they can release or not. Mm -hmm. I think um, that influences probably the quality of your work and what, what you might end up looking for. Um, yeah, it might make your job more boring if you're only looking for blockers versus looking for some of that deeper stuff. I got, I got told, um... I was given a report in a in a meeting, and it was one of those um, pretty intense go no go meetings. And I got some feedback when I when it was like, you know, that situation where all eyes on the room go on to you because now it's like, is it good enough? And I was kind of like, it kind of is. <laughs> like, <laughs> Right, right. If all the eyes like, are going on to you and your answer is not yes or no, but your answer is, let me tell you a story, right? You might bother some people. That might not that, be the way that they're used to handling that information. But I think as long as um, the story is tailored to what they care about. Then it was almost like right. you were in the room with what you just said. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, uh, yeah, Vern, you might want to work on that next time, man, because it's a no go. Uh, it's, everyone's stressed. They just want to know the answer to the thing. It's like, okay, cool. Context. I think that's the really other thing cool. about test reporting is when you do it badly, it's really obvious. No, no. Um, sorry, sorry, real quick. I'm just, no, no, no. no do, do, get, Soraya, get out of here. I'm getting, I'm getting BBC guide here. Soraya, get out of here. <laughs> Soraya, leave. Soraya, Soraya, come on. I'm getting my charger. Okay, all right. Let's shut the door. Sorry, folks. Uh, that was my daughter who wanted to join in. Forgive me, Elizabeth. Continue. Sorry. That's fine. Uh, I don't remember what I was saying now. Oh, no. <laughs> it couldn't have been. It'll come back around if it's that. <laughs> okay. Jessica, thank you for the question. Folks, sorry about my uh, cameo appearance from my little one there. Okay. So we have a we got a bunch of questions. Oh, I remembered what I was saying, which is that if test reporting is bad enough, people will tell you or you will discover for yourself <laughs> because no one will be listening or they'll be really angry. Um, it can be really obvious when it's bad. Um, oh, yeah. I think I learned a lot at my first job in particular by reporting bugs, putting them in the bug tracking system. I decided that that was like the best thing was to have the most bugs in the bug tracking system. <laughs> I have since, yes, I've since changed my approach. But um, a lot of those, but we had uh, a few different, like can't reproduce, like just different options in our bug tracking system, right, of, of ways to close it. And one of them was won't fix. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Um, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know that we literally had something that was like works on my machine or I don't <laughs> care about this, but that's kind of how won't fix acted, right? It was like, I hear you. You're not yeah. wrong, but no. Yeah. It's not happening, observation, but... not fixing it. <laughs> yeah. Like, I'm so proud of you for finding it. Thank you for proving <laughs> that you did some work. That's actually not what I care about. What I care about is the product and the software, and we're not going to fix this. Um, <laughs> Awesome. Yeah.